No, I'm gonna jump down real quick. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna jump. I'm gonna jump down and I'm gonna die. But I want to see what's down here real quick before we continue forward. I don't think there's anything down here, but I don't think I've ever checked either, so. Oh, 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 there's something down here. Chat. It's a little dude. Death counter. Three deaths. Okay, let's see where it, where'd he go? Where'd the little hob, hobgoblin, blah, blah, hobgoblin go? Has to be here somewhere, right? Oh, oh, found him. Hey, buddy. This is definitely the most we found. We found two that we've never found before, so. We are doing well. Yeah, let's make all the noise we can possibly make. Just jump around. No one saw that. I was trying to jump back on the piano keys and just fell directly off to my death. <laughs> Your message is being checked by mods again? Eakin. How do you manage to do this? I, I've never seen anyone else complain, or not not complain. I've never seen anyone else get so consistently checked by mods. It's pretty much almost every stream. Jasper, you still in here, buddy? Can you check his uh, message, and then send it through? Okay, so this dude is up here. Four deaths and counting. I always kind of wanted to jump over there and see if we could, but I don't think we can. So we're gonna just continue forward. The five Poosin. Oh, the five up soon. And five up soon. <laughs> no! We, that is our last death in this game, Kappa. Okay, so we need to get Actually, this part is a little bit difficult, so we may actually die here. We have to get this rotator thing to pull this lever up here, and then pull the hanging piano up so we can jump across the chasm. And while we do that, we're going to look for collectibles in here. But we also have to sneak around this dude. Nope. Nope. Okay, I think we're all good. <laughs> nope. Oh, the way his neck cracks, though. Okay, so let's go light this candle right here. Oh. So, I think we can throw this little monkey over there to distract him. The candle down there that we need to light, but I think we can do that later, maybe. <laughs> Shit. Oh god. No. Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. No, we're not good. Climb up. Climb up, you fool. Oh god. No. Okay, we made it. Oh. Oh, that was terrifying. <laughs> so here's the handle we need. But unfortunately, we cannot 
get back up here. So we need him to come in here so we can get through the door. Which means that we need to turn this TV on to distract him. Before we do that, we're going to look around in here for collectibles. Because loot comes first. Come in here now. The spectacular song that's playing. We should be able to just crawl under here, briefly set this thing down. Light the candle. My ears. No, oh, get pick, pick it up. What, you don't love the television song? <laughs> and then we can lift this piano up. We have to hurry as well because that dude just aggroed because he heard the I think we're good. I think he's over here now, maybe not. All right, moving on though. We have to drag this over here, cover up that steam in order to get past that area. Because steam hurts our fragile little body. I love the TT song. But not you. But not you when you talk, Kappa. <laughs> okay, this is now a silent stream. Muting mic now. Okay, I go. It's boring. You need to talk. <laughs> Already? You only lasted for like 30 seconds. All right. Actually, let's stay in here and make sure there's no collectibles real quick. <laughs> I don't think we can push this door. Oh, we can push the door. I was so hyped for my first silent stream ever. <laughs> oh, shit. I think we can just crawl underneath this dude. Oh! Can we just crawl underneath his hand? Like this. Hell yeah. 
rat. Hey, buddy. I'm basically a rat at this point. Run! Chat, run! So this actually took me a while to figure out last time. But we need to go up here. In between his arms. <laughs> run, Triangle, run! You need to go up here in between his arms and wrench the bars off of that cage so that the thing collapses on him. Let's try this. One more time should do the trick. Sasley has died five times, six times, eight times. What? I haven't died eight times. I think you might, but we could die eight times, I guess. That's true. Okay, there's one. Y you're betting we die two more times? his nasty long slithery arms off which is delightful before we leave here we're gonna look around for any loot as always damn <laughs> that means I win the bet <laughs> what were we what were we betting on Negan <laughs> I think that's the first area completed. Hell yeah. We killed the guy. Or at least we chopped his arms off. Now he's an armless janitor, which would be pretty hard to pull off. Hard to clean stuff without any arms. Especially an entire prison. So this, this should be the second section. Yeah. So these meat hooks, again, are carrying wrapped up children that they're growing in this. There's one right there. They're growing them from babies and then wrapping them up in, in meat wrapping cloth and hooking them on these hooks. Which is kind of freaking disgusting. Let's see where this takes us. I like just the random hook with a shoe on it right there. Hey, there's the cooks. There's one of them, at least. Look at look back there, you see him? In the background. The bet was if I won the bet, you give me a mod. If you win, Roy Jasper gives me a mod. <laughs> that, that seems like an awfully beneficial bet for you. <laughs> All right, so we're hungry again, so we need to find something to eat. We've kind of escalated. We started off with some bread, then we ate a piece, a slab of raw meat. What will we find to eat now? <laughs> Maybe we can eat one of these rats? It's all getting so dark.
So this is when we first start to suspect that she's not a complete child. When she sucks the blood out of a rat for hunger. Bad and she's much smaller than your average child. Come on, we can't go back? Dang, we're gonna look around in there for collectibles. <laughs> okay, well now we're gonna look around in here for collectibles. Whoa, that was weird. That body depressed quite a lot when we stepped on it. Mmm, <laughs> blood. Right? Rat blood, to be specific. The most tasty kind of blood. Vermin blood. Oh, wait. Huh. I don't think we've ever been down here. Oh, shit. No way. So cool, chat. So cool. All right, so there's another matri uh, Matryoshka doll down here. And then there's also a picture of this lady that we saw at the very, very beginning of the game. There's several pictures of, the, of her, actually. And all of the Matryoshka dolls, they're not really Matryoshka dolls, but all of the little dolls are, uh, they look like her. The little little dolls of her. But as we as we progress through the game, we'll find out more about about the lady, the creepy lady. Nice, look, more blood, just what I want. So it looks like we're going into some sort of pantry, which. I'm guessing it has something to do with the cooks. And we also can hear someone sharpening a knife if you listen closely. I'm gonna look around in here for dudes to hug. That's cool, the sponge, look at that. It's possible to knock this over. Maybe when the boat leans back the other way. Guess not. Okay. Look up here. Doesn't look like there's anything. We're gonna go ahead and move on. See who's sharpening the knife. So what's kind of creepy is earlier on we saw a picture of these guys and they were wearing a mask. And if, if we watch his pattern, if we watch what he does, he'll sometimes itch underneath it. So he really is this fat, but he's if you look, his whole head is actually just a mask, which is really freaking weird. Him and his twin brother, actually. Oh. And to make it even creepier, all the meat that they're cutting up, they're pieces of meat from the children that they're growing in this place. I, that we think. That's what I think. Because you see them wrapping up all of the... packages. You see them... And the children being put on the meat hooks. The best blood is not rat blood. It is rotten rat blood. That's true. And that probably was rotten rat blood. The other difference between the, these guys and the uh, dude, the janitor, is that these guys can see. So we can't go in direct line of sight and, and be silent and be safe. Shit. 
I think he, I think he found us. Well, the rat was probably rotten. It had been dead for quite a while. Okay, so I think we, we made it off safe. By hiding under here. <laughs> Let's watch his pattern. He should walk around in a circle cooking stuff. And we should be able to get to this little one over here. I think that their arms might be too short and stubby to actually reach underneath these things. Okay, so let's see if there's a dude to hug over here. Nope. Nope. Shh. Shh. Oh crap, is he gonna look underneath here? He is! Shit, we're dead. Oh no, he just got the salt! It's all good. Safe. He's just salting that fish. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Okay, cool. We need to get the lock to this. And again, the only real viable option is to go up. So we're going to start climbing. There's also a lantern up here. We must complete our 100% lantern run. Got it. I believe there's a couple more up here. Doesn't look like any of these boxes actually have any collectibles on them, so we're gonna keep going forward. The nice thing is we can make as much, as much noise as we want up here and they can't grab us. The only thing I'm gonna grab us is if we fall down. Look at him so desperately trying to reach up here. He just got worn out. <laughs> okay. I'm hoping that the, oh, interesting. Are this other boards that we can walk across? Looks like they are. Hmm, maybe not. But the, the key should be somewhere up here. Again, we saw, we've seen pictures of these guys and one, they have masks on. And two, they have, um, they're twins. Or they look exactly alike. What's even creepier is that they also, apparently, like to sit really close when they use toilets. Also weird that they can't just share a toilet. Yeah, that's yeah, that's also weird. I think the key is right up here. There's a picture of the toilet right there. We're gonna hide underneath this bed. It woke him up when we dropped the key on the ground. He should leave. And then I think we're gonna go up here to make sure there's no collectibles. I don't see any, but we're gonna go up there anyway. <laughs> 